This is the process that we would go through to uh, take a control from a suspect shoe, which would then be used to compare against the any crime prints that might be recovered from a scene of crime. The process involves dusting the shoe with black powder, putting a clear film on the floor that's sticky back to it, and then place the shoe on the film and then apply some weight to the shoe as if it was worn. And then the sticky film can be peeled off and a clear film put over the top of it. This would then obviously be used um, as a control for that shoe alongside the shoe to be looked at in comparison to any prints that might be recovered from a crime scene. This particular process would be done within the, the forensic laboratory and it would be done by a forensic scientist uh, after they've looked for other evidence on the shoe.